<clears throat> oh, I see the red shirt. I see it. I see it, girl. All right, at his position and class. And bounce it. Oos. Cross those arms. Horse stance set. Ayah! Hands together, team. Keegan, Kayushu, Hoken at attention. Bow and give me an oos. Jog in place, team. Let me see you jog in place. Oh, man. You guys know that today we have 10 rounds of sparring today. 10 rounds. Woo -hoo -hoo. You guys, you push yourself at the end of the 10 rounds. Should you be a little tired or really tired? I think you know the answer. Really tired. Jarrell is outside Great day at today. The Academy. How may I help you? Ooh, Jarrell is outside today. I like it. What a good idea. It's a beautiful day. Turn them into jumping jacks. Make them big, make them wide. Good job, Samantha. I like what I'm seeing. Very nice. Turn them into seal claps. Open and close. Let's go, Rohit. Good, Aiden. Make them sharp. Make them sharp. Turn them into crossovers. Good. Turn them into robo jacks. Come on, Mr. Naroda. Alex, I have to say your name loud because it's in all caps. Go, Alex Naroda. That's what all caps means, right? Got to, got to scream it. Back to jogging place. One more time through. One more time through. Just jogging place. We're just getting our body warm. Just getting our body warm, Ariane. Get it, Raul. Get it, Sophia. Go, Isaac. Ooh, Isaac in the tank top. Show me the muscles, Isaac. Show me the mu oh, 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 yeah, baby. Show me the jumping jacks now. Get those jacks. Make them big. Make them wide. We should be feeling really strong. That's it. Looking sharp. Turn them into seal claps now. Come on, Krish. Abhinav. Jemula. Olivia. If you guys can turn on your screen, that would be awesome. Your video, I should say. Layla, if you could put yours on too, that'd be awesome. Crossovers, last one. Or we got one more actually after that. One more after the crossovers. And give me the last one now, RoboJax, Mr. Kyle Lamb. Let me see it, Mr. Kyle. Swing those arms, swing those arms, swing your arms back and forth. Ding, da, ding, 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 ding. Five more seconds. Four, three, two, and time. Shake it out. You get a 10 second breather. 10 second breather. And then I want to see five, just five, of your absolute very best push-ups. Your very best that you can do. So if that means that you have to tilt your camera down so I can see you better, that's fine with me. Okay. Now guys, just show me with your hands. You don't have to type anything in the chat box or answer or unmute. Show me with your hands what your back should look like when you do push-ups. Yep. I've seen some of you guys do this. Exactly. Sometimes what I see is this or this. Okay. So what do we call this whole area around our belt? Everyone say core. Okay. When you do your push-ups, guys, your core should not tilt up and your core should not stay. It should be perfectly what? Show me again with your arm, everybody. Yes. So if I do three, just three for you guys, pay attention. Don't pay attention to my arms. Just pay attention to my core. Did you guys see any shifting up? Did you see any sag? Success. Can you give me five of those? When you're done, stand at ease. Ready, set, go. Show me five. Try to get your nose to touch your floor, if you can. At ease when you're done. Don't smash your nose. <laughs> no, no nose smashes onto your floor, that, that hurts. At ease when you're done. Show me that awesome at ease position. Very good, very good. All right, are you guys ready? We're gonna return to those push-ups in a moment, all right, because they're really important. How many rounds of boxing, kickboxing did I say we were gonna do? Yes, I did say 10. Do you know why we do 10? Because, I'll tell you why, Jarrell. When you test for your black belt like your brother did, you got a big brother senpai, don't you, Jarrell? When you test for your black belt, you do 10 rounds of sparring. Dun, dun, dun. I know, I know. Ten, ten, minutes. one minute each round of the ten minutes. Ten minutes. Each round is one minute long. And usually, you're doing your rounds against the black belt. Someone who's already a black belt, Clyde. It's super tough. Now, if you have a wave master, I suggest you do your rounds on the wave master. If you don't, that's okay. 
Round one and round two are going to be punches only. Your boxing combinations only. Any combos you want to do. All right? At any point, if you guys hear me yell push-up, drop down and give me a strong push-up. Does that make sense? All right. Show me. Hands up, elbows in. Each round is going to be about 30 seconds, so not even like the full minute, like you have to do at a black belt test. At the end of these 10 rounds, we're going to do a sweat test. I'm going to bring everyone's face in front of the screen, and you all should be sweaty. Okay? Uh -huh. Sweaty. Ready? Set. Go. 30 seconds. Shh, shh. Shh. Just boxing. Shh, shh. Stay smooth. Good footwork. Do your pivots. Shh, shh. Double your jabs. Shh. Show me your hooks. Shh. Uppercuts. Shh. Shh. Move that body around. Move that body around. Let's go. You got 15 seconds left. 15 seconds left. I like the way Sophia keeps her hands up. Look sharp. Come on, Arush. Hands up here. Hands up here. Punch with those first two knuckles, everybody. Good. And time. Woo, Sophia hitting that pillow. I like it. We got some targets. All right. All right. I like Ooh, and a high five. I like it. That's good work right there. Okay. I didn't give you any push-ups that round, so be ready. They might be coming. Here we go. Boxing again. Round two. Five. Four, three, two, one, begin. Show me some double jabs. Come on. Shh, shh, shh. Good crosses. Shh. Turn your body. Shh. Use your legs on your uppercuts. Drive with your legs. Turn your hips. Drop. One push-up. Quick. One good one. Get down there. Right back up. Good. Right back to your boxing. Let's go, guys. Your black belt test isn't going to be easy. I promise. Not going to be easy. It's going to be really tough. So push yourself now. Five more seconds in Aya. Four. Fast punches, Alex. Three. Two. And time. Woo. Shake it out and breathe. Shake those arms out. Okay. Now we're adding on rounds three and four. We have all of our punches. But I got to see you guys twisting your hips more. Does that make sense? Give me thumbs up. So when we box, we don't just use our arms. We got to use sh 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 our body. Okay. So we're going to do boxing. We're going to do hands. And what kind of kicks now? What am I showing you guys? Yes, knee kicks. But listen, this is advanced class. I should never see a knee kick below your belt level. Those knee kicks need to drive up and in nice and high, higher than your belt, higher than your belly button. Give me two thumbs up if you got that. Here we go. Round three, hands and knees. Ready, set, go. Shehan? Yes. Um, do we need our boxing gloves? No, you're good. You're good. Just work. Okay. Good question. Move around your room. Move around. Don't stay in one spot. Who's got their pivots going? Who's got their pivots? Come on, Clyde. Hands up. Going to this guy. This guy's working hard. He's moving fast. He's moving in and out. He's losing, using his feet. Toes down on your knee kick. Toes down on the knee kick. That was a good jab cross. Using that body. Five seconds. Four. Three. Two, and time. Good boy, Ariane. Breathe. 15 seconds off. Whose heart is going like fast right now? Whose heart is pumping? Good. If you're like, ah, eh, no big deal. I feel the same way as I did when we started. You're not working hard enough. Here we go. Round four. Round four. Ready, set, go. Punches and knees. Let's go. See your opponent in front of you. Is there an opponent in front of you? Are you working harder and faster than them? Or are they getting the best of you? Good question, isn't it? Drop one push up. Get it. Nose to the floor. Nose to the floor. Core's tight. Right back up. Punches and knees. Punches and knees. Come on, team. Come on, team. You guys got this. Let's go. Woo. 10 seconds. Ooh, I like those hooks because we really twist in the body. That's it. Four, three, two, time. Give yourself two claps. Okay, here we go. Round five. Guess what round five is going to be? If we did punches only before, what do you think round five is going to be? Anyone have a guess? What do you got your guess? What's your guess, Jarrell? Show me. Can you show me? Yeah, kicks only now. Exactly. So now I have to visualize my partner, my opponent. They're not close to me where I can hit them with my punches. They're a little what? A little further yeah, they're a little further away. Now I have to use my kicks. Does that make sense, everybody? All right, kicks only. Here we go. Round five. Ready, set, go. Let me see your kicks. Who's kicking sharp? 
We're going to make this a 35 second round because I want to see how strong you guys are kicking. Elbows in. Try to put combos together. Front kick, round kick. Side kick, front kick. Spin through round kick. Nice, Raul. Beautiful job. Eyes focus straight ahead. Get right back to your spot. Clyde, hands up. Good, Samantha. Come on, Soph. Get those kicks up there. Nice jump front kick, Soph. I saw that. Good. 10 seconds, my friends. Are our hands up? That's what I want to know. Come on. Come on, Rohit. Let's go. We should be tired after this. Five, four, three, two, time. Good, Ahana. That looked nice. Shake it out. Shake it out. All right, here we go. A couple more seconds. Maybe try this time to do like some trick kicks too. Doesn't this look like I'm about to do a front kick and then at the last second, maybe turn it into another kick, right? Kind of mess with your opponent, mess with your partner a little bit. Ready, set, go. Drop one push up. Ha ha ha, I tricked you guys. One push up. Okay, let's go. Right back to kicks. Right back to kicks. Hit them low. Psh. Then hit them high. Psh. Then hit the middle. Psh. Mix up your targets. Ooh, good, son. I like that. Like a half a tornado kick. Ooh, son, a round kick to a spin kick. Look at you go. You're getting on the spotlight. You're getting on the spotlight, sister. She was doubling up her round kicks. Use the top of that foot with the rounds. Top of your foot. You're training really hard, girl. I like it. Top of the foot. That's it. Drop one push up. Come on. Nice. Right back at it. Come on. This is a longer round. This is how we get strong. Five, four, three, two, time. Give that girl two claps, please. That was nonstop action. That was fantastic. Breathe, breathe. Okay. I'm going to show you the next round and you guys can type in the chat box. Okay. What, what I'm doing. What do you guys think I'm doing? This is the next round. Shh, 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 shh. Now what am I focused? What am I focused on now? Only Ow, defense. What do you guys think? Yes. Defense. Defense is super important, right? This is where you really have to use your imagination. Now you got to imagine someone in front of you throwing punches at you, throwing kicks at you and you're blocking them. Dodging. Exactly. Okay. Here we go. Round number seven coming your way. Defense only. Ready, set, go. Who's got good defense? That also shows me that you have a good imagination. Maybe you see that front kick coming. Whoop, you hollow. Salute. Shh. Crunch blocks. Twist blocks. Hollows. Shields. Good, Anaya. Ooh, Anaya with the scoops. I like it. Sophia. Are we working with our brother? <laughs> okay, here we go. Drop one push up. Come on, make it a good one. Come on, Chris. Right back up, right back up. Defense, defense, five. Rohit, hands up, four, three, two, time. Okay, next round. Alex, this is round eight. Everyone show me an eight. Yeah. I call this round D and three. D and three. You know what that means, Arush? That means one defense, and then I counter with how many techniques do you think? Three. One defense, shh, counter, shh, 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 with any three. Does that make sense? All right, but you got to be fast. You can't, can't block, wait forever, and then counter. Block, shh, 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 counter. Fast. Round eight. Ready, set, go. Let's do it. Come on. D and three. D and three. Hands up, Clyde. Hands up. Everybody, elbows in. Good, Isaac. I like how you're keeping your elbows in. D and three. Block, counter. Block, get in there and attack. Drop one push up. Woo. Right back up. Block, counter with three. Block, counter with three. Come on, team. Five, four. Three, two, time. Shake it out. Two rounds left. We now take everything we've already practiced, Anaya, and we smush it together. We make a big old kickboxing sandwich. We got punches. Oh, we got movement. We got kicks. 
We got defense. So this is free sparring now. This is your time now maybe get a little fancy. Give me some spin stuff. Give me some jumping stuff. Get crazy with it. Don't let your imaginary opponent do more techniques than you. Are you guys ready to rock? Give me two thumbs. You got two rounds left. All right, these rounds are gonna be longer though. Are you prepared for this? 45 seconds on the clock. Ready, set, go. You can do one donkey kick around. I saw the question in the chat box. All right, come on, who's working hard? Who wants their black belt one day? Love your movement, Rahul, love it. He moves in, he gets out. I like the crunch box, Sophie, I saw those. Elbows in, Miss Lily. I like the jump front kicks. Ooh, I like the pivot, Anaya. Beautiful job. Get those kicks higher and Alex Naroda. Kicks higher. You guys have 20 seconds. 20 seconds. Ooh, that was a good round kick, Maria. Hoo 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 sister. Go Clyde, it's your birthday. Hands up, Aiden. Hands up, are we looking sharp, Aiden? Come on, you guys have five seconds left. Four, three, two, time. Ooh, shake it out. 45 seconds is a little different, isn't it, Leah? Yeah, you guys are in training. You're in advanced class. You're in training for black belt. Push yourself. Can't always count on me to do it. You can't always count on one of the senseis or a wrenchy or anyone else to push you. You have to do it. Everyone point to yourself. Say, I'm on it. All right. It will be my birthday on the 26th. I was close, wasn't I, Clyde? I didn't even know it was your birthday in April. All right, last round, best round. Here we go. Ready? Should we do a full minute so you guys get the taste of a real minute round? Are you ready, Jarrell? All right, I'm gonna add push-ups in this one to make it tougher. All right, Chris, here we go, last round. It's a full, full minute. Ready, set, go. And if I see anyone slacking, I start the time all the way over. So you better not be slacking. I'm gonna keep spotlighting. Go ahead, Anaya, get it, get after it, come on. We're on the clock, we're on the clock. Go, girl, go, girl. Come on, Ariane, go, Ariane. You're doing great, Ariane. <laughs> Good job. Ooh. I'm going to put a bunch of you guys out. Ooh, look at this. Double team spotlight. We got a double team spotlight. It's like girl power day. I'm just saying. It is girl power day. <gasps> girl power day. I love it. Don't worry. We got a boy up here. Come on. Hands up, Alex. What do we got? And a boy. Come on. We got 15 seconds. We got 15 seconds. Drop two push ups. Give me two. Nose to the floor. And right back up, right back to boxing and kickboxing. Right back to it. Come on, you got five seconds. Four, three, two, and time. Beautiful, beautiful job. Give yourself two claps. All right, let's do this. Bring it in. I want to do a sweat check. Bring it in. Who's got some sweat happening? Do you really, though? Let me see. What do we got? Hmm, I'm checking. I'm looking. I'm checking. Does anybody have like real sweat? Really? Oh, show me. Yeah, you got a little sweat because it's a little warm out today. Drill, you got to be sweating. You're in the hot sun. Yes, you are? You got some droplets? All right, everyone go grab a quick drink quickly. Good job, team. Quick sip and then right back in. Quick sip. Yes, Isaac. You got some sweat? Good boy. Come on back in 10 seconds. Drink up that water. If you are testing for a belt for a strike, your smothering bear better be on point. Last week, when I had you guys, last Wednesday, there was an important word we talked about. When someone grabs you, especially with this move, you have to have a sense of, and it began with a you. Er, does anyone remember? Type it in the chat box. Aiden McPherson, good job, my man. That is exactly right. Urgency. Everyone say that word again. Say urgency. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. Everyone show me your ready position. Show me your ready position. Okay. Excellent. What I'd like everyone to do is close their eyes in a second. As soon as you hear me yell, go, eyes open, and then you perform smothering bear, not like you're a red belt, not like you're an advanced red belt, not like you're a brown belt and not like you're an advanced brown if you happen to be one of those belts. You perform this move like you're already a 
black belt. I saw Alex's mouth. He mouthed the words exactly right. Already like you're a black belt. Okay. Show me that ready position again. Eyes closed. So now you're just listening for my voice. Eyes closed. Eyes closed. Soon as I go, drop and bump. Whole move. Smothering bear. Go. Urgency. Urgency. Get out of there. Good. And nice. And then when you're done, show me ready position again. Okay. Eyes closed. Eyes closed. Ready. Set. Go. Make sure you look where you're striking. Look. Good, Sophia da Silva. Very nice. Ready position. Ready position. Ready. Set. Eyes closed. Go. Nice. God. Nice. 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 Awesome. Okay. Ready position. Now eyes open. Look at me. So now it's not going to be the cue of my voice. Now you have to watch me. So now when you see me guys basically do this, that's the hug. Once I get the hug on you, what do you have to do? Perform the move. Okay. I'm not going to say a word. You just got to watch me. Show me your ready position. I'll try to get you guys. Nice. Good. You got to get low. You got to get low. Back to ready. Shh. Again. Try to get you guys again. Can everyone see me okay? All right, cool. All right, cool. Ready? Oh, I got you, Samantha. Go. Drop. Boom. Beautiful. Ready position. This is your last one. Make it your best one. Ready? Set. Good job, guys. All right, shake it out. Here's what we got. 20 seconds of push-ups. Push-ups were our theme today. Here's why push-ups are so important really quick. I'm going to give you three reasons. Three. Three quick reasons. Clap, take a knee. Number one is part of your fitness test for your black belt test. So if you want to become a black belt, your push-ups have to be correct. Number two, what area of the body did I say it strengthens? Core. But of course, also our what? Yep, our chest muscles and our arm muscles. Now look at this. What muscles do you think I use when I throw all these punches? The same ones that we do push-ups. And when we kick, what exercise helps our kicks? So you see what I'm saying? So these aren't just pointless exercises, right? These exercises help our martial arts. So number one reason, it's on the fitness test, part of your black belt test. They have to be correct. Number two, they're going to improve your punches. And number three, it's just cool to do more push-ups than your friends. Not going to lie. Clyde, it's just cooler to be able to do more push-ups than your friends. Don't you guys agree, Anaya? It's like if your friend can't even do one and you're like over there busting out five, 10, 15. Come on now. You all admit it. Clyde's got a big smile on his face. He's like, yeah, it is cooler. It is cool to be able to do more push-ups than all your friends that don't do karate, right? All right, 20 seconds is on my clock. Then you're going to write in the chat box how many good ones you did. All right, here we go. Ready? Finish strong. Set? Go. 20 seconds. Come on. I'm watching for good technique. Where's that core? Is it sagging? I hope no one, there's no camels in this class. No camels. Clyde, come on. Drop down. Give me push-ups. What you waiting for? Five seconds. Five. Come on, push. Breathe. Four. Good, Anaya. Three. Come on, Christopher. Two and time. Beautiful job. Beautiful job. Okay. Show me standing. Feet shoulder width. Reach those hands to the ceiling. Take a deep breath in. Now exhale and reach for those toes. Legs are straight. Hold it there. No bend in your legs. Hold it there. Try to touch those toes. Come on. Who can get to their toes? That's what I'm looking for. Time. Come on up. Now, take your feet a little closer together. They don't have to be perfectly together. Not like a tension, but pretty close. Reach up again. Deep breath in. No bending the knees. And drop. <sighs> Breathe. Come on up, shake it out. We got one more. You guessed it. Now put those feet together like you're standing at attention. Breathe in and out. 
No bend. Try to relax here. These are going to help your axe kicks, your cresting kicks, your front kicks. Time. Come on up. Now open them wide. Wider than a horse stance. Now push those knees out and put your hands right at the top of your knees and sit your booty down. This stretches our groin. See how I'm rocking a little side to side? That's okay. Good job, team. Should be a little tough. Good. Now hands on the floor, right toes up. Nice. Yeah. See how my right foot, my left elbow is on the inside of my leg. Switch, pull yourself to the other side, toes up. Good job, guys and girls. On your butts. Last one, butterfly. Good, and time. Bring it in and take a knee. Guys, we've been talking about having good habits, haven't we? Right? And the habit that we're going to talk about today is an easy slogan to remember. It's called dinner before dessert. Now, most of you guys know this already, right? Like if you think about a meal, you usually have to have your meal first. And then if you're going to have something sweet, it comes after the meal, right? Would we all agree that's how it is in, in your house? Yeah, right? That's pretty much how it is. Well, it's the same thing for anything else, right? So if we have some times, here's a perfect example, okay? I told Riley, my daughter, today in the car on the way up to class today, we had this conversation. She was asking me about the next black belt prep cycle. And that starts the end of this month. And she wants to be in it, which is great. Now, here's what I had to tell her though. A couple days ago, her friend invited her to go to the mall with her and her mom on Friday night. So I said, sure, that's fine, you can go. Now, here's the thing. If she were prepping and she was in the cycle to be testing for her black belt, Guess what class is on Friday night? I saw Samantha's mouth move. Prep class is on Friday night. Would Riley have a decision to make? She sure would. She would have to ask herself, what's more important? Really wants to go to the mall with her friend, right? Really, really wants to go. How many of you girls love to go to the mall? Even some of you boys like going to the mall too, right? Cool stores in there for you guys too. Yeah. I get it, right? Now I said, maybe this could have happened and this would have been like flipping it around a little bit. Maybe you can go to the mall, but as long as they have you back home by 6.30 in enough time to get to karate, you could do both. Now, what if she said, no, they, they wouldn't have me back until 8.30. Then Riley's got a decision to make, huh? So now dinner would be the training. Dessert would have been the mall. Dinner, training before dessert, fun, mall. Does that make sense, everybody? Now, if she's not in, in, in the cycle, which she isn't right now, it's okay to go out and have fun. She's still getting her two classes in, no big deal, right? That's okay. But I want you guys to realize that if you want to get better grades, if you want to go for your black belt, if you want to do things that are really important and your goals are big, then your discipline needs to be big. Does that make sense, everybody? That sometimes we have to choose the not so fun thing. And all of you guys one day are going to be in the cycle and we talk about this. You may have to skip birthday parties. You may have to skip other events that sound fun to make it to your classes because your dream, your goal is that big. Does that make sense, everybody? What was the slogan, Sophia? Dinner before, dinner before dessert. That's right. All right. Awesome job today, my friends. Show me your at ease position. Let's bow it out. Good job doing your 10 rounds, guys. Class up. Give me a strong bow. Oos. Two big claps for yourself. And I like everyone that's wearing their Satori gear. I see some of you guys not in your clothes. So make sure that every time you come to class, you have your gear on or at least Satori t shirt, something Satori, right? It puts you in the right mindset when you have your gear on to train. Make sense, everybody? Give me two thumbs up if you feel me on that. Fantastic. All right. Gonna mute you guys. Bye.
Thank you. Enjoy this nice Bye. weather. Go outside. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye. Go enjoy. We got a lot of daylight left. Bye.